It was near the end of the war, and after 4,000 years, the Core Empire stood on the brink of final victory over the Arm Rebellion. Arm forces throughout the galaxy were overwhelmed by the superior numbers and firepower of the ruthless Core. Their bid for freedom nearly lost. The battered remnants of the Arm military clustered in the single star system which contained its home world, Empyreon. Empyreon too would have fallen were it not for the skill of the sole surviving Arm commander. A shrewd tactician and resourceful warrior, the commander took advantage of the system's relative isolation and was able to keep the enemy at bay. Arm troops weathered wave after wave of core attacks, and it seemed as though they would be able to do so indefinitely. The stalemate ended when a small core insertion team managed to slip through planetary defenses and establish the last of a chain of space-folding galactic gates which led directly to the surface of Imperion. A decoy engagement was staged at the Arm outpost on the outer planet of Calibran in order to lure the commander away from Imperion, leaving the planet virtually defenseless. The invasion began. central consciousness was smashed, its control centers burned out, and power systems in ruins. The Corps commander and the remaining Corps forces had regrouped to make a final stand. No quarter would be asked, and none given. The arm would not rest until the Corps had been wiped out completely. The fate of the galaxy must be ensured. <laughs> 